Are you tired of that pesky cardboard getting in the way of your figures? There's gotta be a better way! Introducing Booster Knight, the easiest way to open a booster. Using nanofiber carbon Bluetooth technology. All right guys, day five, no chase yet. One booster, this could be a big day. I'm really excited. I'm also kind of sad because that means it's the end of our brick unboxing series, but let's just get right into it and let's hope for the best. Okay, well, uh... <laughs> This is a figure that I don't think I am going to talk about. The rest of the booster we will get into. And I'm not sure how much is new here. We've got the common She-Hulk, which we saw in Florida, I believe. We've got Emil Blonsky again, who's actually in the pack from yesterday. We've got, ooh, okay, new one is uh, Saracen, the Uncommon. So yeah, really filling out the She-Hulk show, the Obama Stay group, and then we actually have another Madison who was also in our booster from yesterday. So that is interesting. We'll get those guys set off to the side and we'll find Saracen's card. This is actually really cool though. So we did get a lot of She-Hulk in the set. We also have a little primer for the Heroclix Avengers and Heroclix X-Men Gala sets. And you can see She-Hulk she is ripped in this. I don't know if we've ever seen a Hulk like this jacked, so <laughs> she's probably going to hurt. And then we have what appears to be like a Wolverine. I think that's Laura Kinney. Eh, don't shoot me if uh, I'm wrong. I see the two claws. I'm going to go out with that. But that's fun. I really like what they're doing with these booster cards, kind of hinting at what's going to be in the next set. But let's talk about the meat. So Saracen will set all these guys off to the side. He is, let's see, Abomaste, Brute, Monster, Mystical, Obsessed with Blood is the first trait. Steal Energy, when Saracen heals, after resolutions, remove an action token from him. Okay, so we can kind of keep going. And then he has the Abomaste therapy session as well, so that's remove an action token from Saracen. If you do, give an action token to a friendly character with the Abomaste keyword within four squares. So we've seen that uh, on a lot of figures now, I think probably at least five or six. And then the dial is pretty simple. This seems like it's going to be a great sealed pull. You can never go wrong with probability control. So some charge blades, willpower. It's probably going to go down pretty easily, but if you can get one good attack off with him or just use that prob and sealed, you'll probably get some value there. No team abilities. Honestly, not a ton going on with this guy, but he is pretty fun, and I'm interested to see how the Obama State keyword is really going to play out with each other. Could be a fun mechanic. Yeah. Dude, I know. <laughs> All right, we'll, uh, we'll get to the fun part of this, but guys, uh, it would just be, I think, blasphemous if I was the person to talk about this one. So, we'll cut to him. Guys, I am really excited to talk about our chase. Uh, I'm probably more excited that it even exists. Earlier in the week when we started off, I mentioned I would love to see something from Rogers the Musical from Hawkeye, especially how they brought it to Disneyland. And that is indeed our chase. It is the Steve actor from the musical where they sing I Can Do This All Day. Uh, and as a massive musical theater nerd and part-time player in it, I'm very excited that we get a musical theater Captain America character. This is awesome. So Steve is 40 points. He has the Avengers Initiative team ability. He's got one keyword. It's celebrity. He's a star, baby. Uh, his trait is Rogers the Musical. Well, first off, dude, the dial is so sick. He has six range, triple target. Hypersonic speed is kind of like dancing. He's moving and grooving on the stage. He has zero damage with Perplex. I love that he has a 15 defense blank all the way through because he's just up on stage, you know? Uh, and then he's got Incapacite, so he's incapping the crowd with his performance, captivating them with his singing. So, Rogers the Musical, at the end of your turn, if two or more friendly characters moved and hit this turn, oh, this is like uh, Flash's Speed Force. This is so sick, actually. Give Steve a choreography token. Steve and friendly characters within range can use the following effects based on the number of his choreography tokens. So when you move, you hit. You're dancing, you're performing the number. This is so awesome. So it's up to four choreography tokens, it looks like. So if he has one token, they all get sidestep within range. That's really good. If he has two, this character automatically breaks away. If he has three, they all have probability control. And then if he has four, everybody gets safeguard, outwit, pulse wave. Whoa! Okay, so you kind of have to build up to it. It takes at least four turns to get there. But man, that's awesome. Just on your third turn, if you hit, and then all of you have prob for the next turn of attacks coming in. So he's got another trait. I can do this all day. This little really long, strong out day. 
Uh, willpower, the first time Steve would be KO'd, instead you turn him to click five. Roll a d6 and heal him equal to half the result, protected pulse wave. So he's got living legend in his own way, and then he has his special <laughs> damage, or his special defense is intermission. Stop. Steve can't be healed above this click, so that's exactly halfway in the middle of his dial. He has a stop for intermission. Gosh, this is hilarious. So that's Steve. That is our chase. I, I love the musical references. I love everything about this piece. He... This is so freaking funny, guys. So that, I think this is an awesome way to end the note of our Disney Plus next phase unboxings this week. We gotta see a hilarious chase that, I mean, this has gotta be like one of my favorite figures of all time right now. This is like perfect, I love it. So thank you guys so much for staying tuned with the unboxing. Hopefully you enjoyed this week. Let me know in the comment section below what you thought. All I'm gonna say is it's been getting really weird around here lately. And I'm starting to think letting Big K direct our show isn't the best. You thought we were just doing a brick? You're funny, hilarious, a comedian. Me? I'm sure you're watching me right now thinking, Ian, you're crazy. And I would too if I was you watching me, but I'm not, so I don't. Let's take a little peek at the pizza. This box set is gonna include two of your favorite heroes, Hulk and She-Hulk, as well as some awesome bystanders. And now you're probably thinking, Ian, Super Bowl's coming up. I've got friends, hungry friends. One pizza, that's not gonna, oh, I've got two more. Enough for everybody, all your friends. See you Monday, we've got more.